of the Messiah. He was one of the greatest teachers of his day. I believe that on purpose, he found himself taking his time on his way to Jairus' house. Every now and then on purpose, God will take his time as he begins to build you, develop you, cultivate you, as he begins to put you up. It's going to be on purpose. The problem in the church is we're looking for a quick fix. We're looking for quick and speedy. We're looking for a quick manifestation to be played out. But every now and then, you got to conclude within yourself that this miracle, this victory, this joy, this peace, and this healing is going to take some time. I've been at it last year. I've been at it last month. I've been at it the past two weeks. And it seems like ain't no way. Oh, no way. It seems like ain't no standard. Ain't lifted up in the dry place. But I want to remind somebody under the sound of heaven that he's a present help in the time. At, at the inaugural process and at the inception uh, of something dynamic beginning to happen. Huh? But I want you to begin to look at the frustration huh, that is going on around him. Huh? There's some folks now that are questioning his motive. God, somebody that missed that. There's some folks now huh, that is questioning whether or not huh, he's half past man or retired. Huh? Whether or not he has a hidden agenda. Huh? There's some folks now huh, that's questioning huh, whether or not he's really called of God. Huh? Because it seems like the situation is dead. Huh? Oh. 